Section 10.2, matrix, no matrix Notation and Gaussian Elimination. Another way to solve systems of equations is to use matrices. A matrix is a rectangular array of numbers called entries or elements. An element is an, or an entry is an indiv individual piece of a matrix it is a number. The order of a matrix is the number of rows by the number of columns. So usually we refer to matrices as M by N, where M and N are rows and columns. For example, here's matrix A. Each element has the notation of a lowercase a. So our matrix is capital A. Our elements are lowercase a. I, J, where I tells us which row we're in and J is which column. Thus, A11 is element 4, first row, first column. A12 is negative 1, first row, second column. A31, third row, first column, that's 9. And lastly, because this matrix has three rows, and two columns, we say that the order of A is a 3 by 2. Let's look at an example. Here's another matrix A. A is the matrix negative 27, 0, 1, 5, negative pi, 13. I want you to determine the order of A the value of A13 and the value of A21. Try this on your own first and then resume the video when you're ready to check your solution. The order of A, we see that we have two rows and three columns. So our order is a two by three matrix. A13 is first row, third column, that's one. And A21 is second row, first column, that's gonna be five. An augmented matrix. An augmented matrix is a special type of matrix. It is a linear matrix, or is a matrix of a linear system of equations. consisting of the coefficients of the variables with an adjoined column consisting of the constants from the right hand side of the system. This is really important that this type of setup requires that your equations be in standard form. Standard form is when all of our variables, so we have ax plus by plus cz equals some constant, we'll say w. And now we'll look at an example to see what the augmented matrix looks like. 